What makes a good story? I think a good story depends on how much you can look at a story and how it reflects upon your life and your own realities. Like stories that have an aspect or a character that just feels like me or that relates to an aspect of my life. And maybe your own fantasies too, maybe a story can reflect your inner desires. It's kind of like a realm of possibilities which aren't able to be reflected within your, within your own reality. For me what makes a good story are stories about the human condition. Stories about life, the highs and lows of life. But that's also not to negate really stupid stories like big blockbuster nonsense. A good story is one that's really exciting, whether that's romantic or a plot twist. I love a good plot twist. I feel like sad stories are the ones that just stay in the back of my head. When someone tells you about a sad moment or something that happened to them or someone they love, you get to kind of feel how they felt for that person or whatever happened to them. I'd say stories that are quite sentimental that sort of get to you, you know, like get quite emotional stories, like Pixar or something. Um, well, I mean, stories can be in any medium. Like, they can just, it can be obviously like something classic like a book or a movie, but they're like an Instagram post or like social media or something like that. Like, the fragrance advert has to sort of have a story so that you're relating to the thing they're trying to tell you or the thing they're trying to sell you. Video games are unique in that you're part of the story and your actions and interactions affect the outcome. I think books would have been it back in the day. A book forces you to engage with the story, because if you simply stop reading, it ends. But that, that's a dying art form. I feel bad for them, but books are kind of dying out a bit. It's an active process that compels one to use their imagination. The way I see narrative is kind of a way to kind of divert and enter a reality which is slightly exaggerated from our own. You know, it's kind of in a, like a, a fantasized version of our own reality. Tell us a story. So this is a story I really liked uh, telling. So basically it's about this guy who has a relationship that's just not, it's just not working out. There's no spark there anymore. So he's just wanted to be a cook. He traveled across the desert of Slough. And he went to the shop, okay, and he saw this old lady getting robbed. Some guy was stealing her cucumbers. Uh, she started screaming at me. And it sounded like, it made like a buzzing sound. So I just looked it straight into the woman's eyes. So I started panicking. I got so scared. So I... Bonks the guy on the head. He goes to the ground, right? He's bleeding everywhere. He's dead. And it scared, it literally scared me so much. And I ran away all the way home. And he went back home and no one recognised him. And it got really sad. I mean, that was pretty embarrassing. And I think that is the weirdest story I've ever heard. And you're like, what? What just happened? So yeah, that's my story.